Boo! Ass. Boo! Oh, sweet Jesus. Ah! Get off my head! Slow down is obnoxious. Makes this very difficult to do. Ow, please stop hitting me. Oh dear. This has gone poorly. Me, uh, move somewhat. You. First to die. Mmm, I missed. Ah! Damn it, Peter, just target the man. Ah! This is not going well at all. I get the feeling these things can dodge. Alright, plan B. Plan B. That went rather poorly. I blame the frame rate issues more than anything. And the fact that I couldn't seem to shoot anything. Alright, I'm just gonna reload. Yes, I'm very dead, thank you. Importantly, let's mix. Let's play sorted. Right. Now we can get something done in here for a change. And heal up, probably, actually. Hmm. Cool. And wait, right. Now we got to run around in circles for a while. That was my fault. So we want to get in here. We also want to get across the other side, but this will do for now. So it's a five point. Wait, no, it's one, two, three. Four. Is that seven points? Oh my lord! No, we ain't going in there anytime soon. Let's see if we can find this damn fuse first. Perhaps we'll find one in the old place. It looks like the guard got killed too. Rather unfortunate for him. D don't mind that quick save in the corner there. That last section gave me a little bit of grief. Hands off her! It's cool! I saved you! You're welcome. Ugh. Damn it! This gun is crap and I'm lousy at shooting it. Eat my Chaturgat powered gun, you piece of shit. The altar stands. Nasty rats. Stop hissing at me, you little bastards. Uh, lady, you haven't seen a fuse anywhere, have you? Nervously shaking from her ordeal, the nurse tries to calm herself and thank Peter for saving her life. You may not want to step out there, then. It's rather unpleasant, full of unnecessary horrors. Speaking of unnecessary horrors... Pardon me, old bean. Ow! Well, this could be problematic. Okay, plan B. Now, can I get off a damaging spell? Nope! Apparently not. Alright, old fashioned way. Right you are, my dears. Be sane now. Sane people will shoot at dead bodies. Oh. Right. <laughs> now, Peter, pull your finger out. Hmm, could do with that, to be honest. Better than nothing. A 
The box is medical supplies. No, I don't really care about medical supplies. Though the torch isn't particularly unhelpful. We use it to burn crispy people to death. I'm glad you're not evil, madam. I'd hate to have to shoot your head off in a moment of madness. This is where people hide stuff, right? Like fuses and swords and sword. Thank God, a two-edged sword. I'll finally, start attacking things. Good on you, Peter. Now we can actually start murdering. Hmm, what else can we check? Well, the weapon's certainly handy. However, that's not quite what I'm looking for. Have we explored everyone here? Hmm, certainly looks that way. The other door doesn't work anymore, does it? So, now it's a case of more wandering around so I know what I'm looking for. I assume that little thing over there still isn't open. Worth a quick look, however. No. But there is something in there I need, no doubt. The one place I can't go, I need a seven circle for. Hmm. I assume it's not working, but of course I haven't checked. I'd feel a bit silly if I didn't. Very old piece of paper. Mm, sheet of music. Handy. Yeah, I need the power. Right, go figure. Alright, you get your breath back. I'll wait. It's fine. No problem. Actually, while we're here, and since we have full magic. Oops. The most sinister of shit, but it does the job. It's only a bit of magic, no problem. Right, we know there's one of these dick noses out here, so we need to be careful. Not to get our asses chopped up. How you doing, Captain? I got a sword now. We hardcore. We're doing this simply because I will lose sanity again, and it's just a bit of a pain in the ass at the moment. Because this is going to happen. Get off! <clears throat> my shield did protect most of my sanity loss here, though, which is helpful. I didn't miss any items. I wouldn't put it past them hiding something completely out of the way, but it's best to check, I suppose. I didn't see any shiny shit the last time I was up here, but perhaps I needed to murder first. Ah, you followed me down. Convenient. Now I haven't got to go up there to kill you. Oh, it's an Ulioff one. Kill it like the rest. Yes, Lord Guru, it's dead. Alright, so... Now with that dead, there's actually anything up here to look at. No. Alright, now I'm running out of places to look, really. This could be problematic. This is literally a case of now I've restored some power, I can go fondle with the, uh, the box. I think it might be a good time for me to have a look around. Do excuse me. I did have a quick idea on the way down here, because I remembered looking at the Lucky Penny right at the start. I was like, oh, what's that for? In a rush inventor, as Peter jams the Lucky Penny in the place of a fuse. Amazingly, it works. The fuse has been replaced. Yeah, by ship. Fucking luck. Whatever. Give me power, please. So I can play some music. All this for some music. Only in a horror game. Well, let's see if this theory is correct and this opens up the ability to get a seven point spell. About to find out, I suppose. Eggs? That made me jump! Which I played the organ. Balls it. Sorry. Shrugging.
Bollocks. Okay. Why am I so bad at this? Like, I'm just following instructions. It's mainly because, to be fair, X on my controller right now is not the X I'm looking at, which makes this a little bit more complicated. A, B, Y, X. It should be B, Y, A. There we go. Oh, goody, I forgot about this. I'm going to have to restart the game, aren't I? Unless it actually stops. Are you going to stop? Are you going to stop? You're not going to stop by yet. No. Let's see what it is before I get too pissed off. There is a door handle. Should I pick up the door handle? Um, yes please. And now I'm going to save the game and restart it so we don't have that music all the time. I'm too good to you. The darkness is coming, it's not safe to save right now. Arse! Get out of the way, the music is playing! It's loud and obnoxious. Jesus guys, there's only a door handle. It's freaking you out so much. Alright, we get downstairs now. Can I save now? Yay! I will be back shortly. So... Now we can see what's been harassing us. There's something else up here that's been harassing me. I'm not quite sure I can use this door handle. Unless I can use my door handle over here. Oh, I severely doubt it. I'm gonna do with my door handle. Peter cannot use a door handle now. A door handle for open obscure door. It doesn't appear to belong in any particular door in sight. Well, I can't think of anything else that's not been accessible as of yet. This is something in the basement, perhaps. That's one last place to check before, because I can't disable that without a seven point, which is problematic since I don't have one currently. I could do with some health in it. Mm, health. I want a shield. Some health. Mm. Excellent. Down we go. I didn't check, so I might humour it. As far as I'm aware, nothing else is open down here. Except for noise. They don't even keep their own secret passages the same. How rude is that? Except for the creepy ass noise. No, I didn't think so. There appears to be a hole in the wall. It's large enough for a small dog to pass through. Well, not a dog per se. However, what I can do... Oh, I'm going to have to get my sanity back first. That's boring. Sorry, people. Sanity's going away. Needed to control something. That's not as much sanity as I was expecting. Damn it, Peter, you're a hard man to please. Apparently, controlling otherworldly creatures does something bad to your sanity. Who would have guessed? Summon Trapper. Mm. Mantle where you cannot use in summoning. The binding of Mantor is weakened it can no longer be fueled incantation to Skyne. Aww. That's for someone who asked. So, no, we cannot summon Mantorok thingies. Sadly. Whoop! Oh, they're cute. I love the little horns. I want one as a pet. They'd be kind of pissed if it, you know, got rid of me. Ah, dead person. Oh, what we can do, though. Later's mate. No, we transport him away to God knows where. However, we have solved our dilemma. If I'd remembered how to do this, we'd have solved this a bit earlier. A circle of power sits atop a stack of crates in the middle of the room. Now we can summon real shit. Peter has acquired a circle of power. Good for you, Peter. Good for you. Now, of course, this does mean we've got to fanny around with all the spells again, which is slightly irritating. 
would hate to make this convenient now, would we? No, we don't like convenience in here. However, we can now get past the barrier that has kind of blocked us along the way. Which is good, because I was getting kind of stuck, and like I said, I really don't remember how to do this. Now, I'm going to get a few essential spells ready in the seven points to excuse me. Okay, so, uh, I made a new spell. Uh, powered up some old spells as well. The ones that matter, like the shield, the spell magic. If you're invisible, recover an item. So, we got some cool ones. Uh, hopefully I can show you what I can do. Although one of them does go horribly tits up if we run out. Which would be amusing.